Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Gigi and today I am going to show you how I made this bow. Now for this bow, you are going to need half a pipe cleaner, a pair of scissors, your measuring tape, wired ribbon, now I'm using pumpkin wired ribbon, and a glue gun. So let's go ahead and get into it. Now for the ribbon, we are going to measure out three pieces. Our first piece, we are going to measure out six and a half inches. So about right here is six and a half. Go ahead. So that's six and a half. Our second piece is going to be five inches. Um, five inches, about right here. And our last piece is going to be four and a half inches. So four and a half is about right here. Okay. Oh, I think I cut a little over, but that's okay. So my bottom piece is a little over four and a half, but that's okay. Essentially, you want a six and a half, a five inch, and a four and a half. Now the five inches, we're gonna just put them off to the side. And these are gonna be the strips that you want. So we're gonna get our six and a half. And we're gonna put glue on one end. Either end, um, doesn't really matter, but we're going to glue them and then we're gonna create a little loop. So let me go ahead, get my glue gun. I'm really sorry, I'm shaky today and I don't really know why. So press one side down and the other side. Now be careful when you squeeze it because obviously the glue is hot. You don't want to burn your fingers. And you only want to put a little bit. This is why I cut six and a half, just so I can have that extra space to overlap them. There's that piece. And let's go ahead and do the same for the four and a half inch piece. I just put glue on one end. And put it together. There you go. Oop. Hold it. Okay. All right, so that's one piece. This is the other piece. So once you have your pieces, we are going to lay them on top of each other. So you wanna kinda flatten them out a bit and just lay them on top of each other like that. Okay, so this is an easy way to remember since my wired ribbon has orange, we want the wired ribbons on the top and on the bottom. So on the top and on the bottom. So here, you're gonna fold it together. So you're gonna wanna, I kind of just squeeze the middle, fold it like that, squeeze it and fold it so it'll look like this there 
because you want your right wire to like point up does that make sense i hope it makes sense you're just gonna pinch it really tight and at this point you're gonna get your pipe cleaner and you're just gonna in the middle just tightly pinch it and on the back you're just gonna give it a twist like a, a like a hard tight squeeze twist so once it's twisted at this point you can fluff it up just to kind of see where everything's at See, I'm not that great because for some reason, one side's always bigger than the other. Like the same on this one, this side was bigger, but that actually kind of works out for what I want these for. So I'm gonna just leave it like that for right now. And then you're gonna go ahead and grab your five inch piece. And you're gonna fold it in half. And you're gonna go ahead and dove, dovetail it just with your scissors. So get your scissors and, oh, that's kind of bad. I mean, oh, okay. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on with me today, but that's okay. Everybody has those days. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I really did a bad job, so let me go ahead and retry that. I have no idea how to fix this. Um, I'll be right back, you guys. Okay, you guys, so I'm just having a really off day, but I did this. But it's fine. It's fine. I'm just going to go ahead and use it. So this is the five inch piece, and you want to dovetail it if you like. You don't have to, but yeah, just ignore this side. And at this point, I'm just going to pinch it together and fold it as evenly as in half as possible. Now, with the pipe cleaner in the back, I'm just gonna go ahead and tie on the tail. And we're gonna leave this excess pipe cleaner because I'm going to attach this to something. And then just Fix the tail downwards. Now I like the flat looking bow. I think it looks interesting. Kind of reminds me of like a scarecrow. I don't know, for some reason I see the flat bow at least with this ribbon and I'm thinking of a scarecrow. But yeah, so this is how I made them really easy really simple this is the other one but yeah i can't wait to show you what i'm going to do with these and i hope you have a wonderful day and i'll talk to you guys next time bye